Hi everyone, it's Beth. Today we're gonna to be making over one of those chalkboards from Dollar Tree into some cute spring decor. So I used one of these little bunny cutouts from Dollar Tree, a piece of burlap, one of their chalkboard stands, some twine, Scrabble letters I got in bulk from Amazon, a little bow, some Mod Podge, home decor antique wax, scrapbook paper, and hot glue. And what I did was took some of the home decor wax and put it on the bunny cutout because I'll be putting the burlap right on here and I didn't want any of that unfinished wood to show through. So I just gave it a quick coat of the wax, took a baby wipe to blend it in. And then I did the same thing with the chalkboard stand on all of the unfinished wood parts. Just covered it in the wax and blended it in with a baby wipe. Next, I just kind of set the bunny cutout on the piece of burlap I had and just cut off most of the excess. And then I did a layer of the Mod Podge on the front of the bunny and then placed down the burlap and smoothed out any of the wrinkles. And I did use my heating tool to speed up the drying process. And then once I had all of that dry, I did the outer layer of Mod Podge on that as well. And next I took the chalkboard stand and put it on the back of the scrapbook paper. And the scrapbook paper I did get from Hobby Lobby. So I just traced out the front part of that and cut it out. I put a generous layer of Mod Podge on the front of the chalkboard and then Place down the scrapbook paper and smooth out any bubbles or wrinkles. And then did the outer layer of Mod Podge on there as well. While that was drying, I took the bunny cut out and cut off any of the excess burlap. And when I put the Mod Podge on there, when it dries, it makes it pretty stiff, so it's pretty easy to cut and it doesn't fray at all. It's so super cute. And then I took a sanding block and sanded off all the excess paper around the chalkboard. Once that was all done, I took the twine and just put a little bit of hot glue on the very edge and place that down there. Being careful not to burn my fingers. So I just ran a strip of a little bit of hot glue right along the edge and put the twine all around the whole chalkboard so it was like a border.
and then I took the Scrabble letters and placed them at the very bottom, spelling out spring. And I put all the letters down first to make sure that they would all fit and I'd have them all lined up correctly. And then just took one at a time, hot gluing them into place. Then I took my bunny cutout and hot glued that right above the Scrabble letters. And then took this little bow tie bow I had made and placed that with hot glue on the bunny. And that is it. Super simple but super adorable. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video.